this is Jeff Gaither in the house for the criminally insane with uh, Shane and Amy on the road to nowhere. When I was started out, I wanted to do like to shock people, but at the same time do something that I would be remembered for. That's sort of like a black and white, ain't it? What do you mean? Like mixed emotion, you're doing something to like almost comical to shock people, and at the same time you're being serious about it to be to make something of yourself. I don't know, I just seem sort of lying. Well, basically, that's the uh, that's the original piece for Guitar Hero 3. I've done two pieces for them that was used at uh, like different venues in the game. And that's like a printout of the, the One for Lou's Inferno. And they've used like uh, a couple other posters throughout the game, like my monster sperm, and I think they use electric Frankenstein poster. Uh, there's like four or five different posters that you can see in there. I've had a couple people, printers, reject my work. Really? Yep, I actually have. Not printed. You're kidding? Nope. Was it, it was just no uh, sexual? Was it no, sexual? No, I don't know. To be honest, I don't really do that much sexual stuff, hardly any. Right. Um, no, I think it was like just some mutilation type of stuff. Mutilation, I might have a cross involved. But yeah, they actually, they, uh, for some reason, they started printing it, and then like, the owner come in and was all upset, so they threw it all away. And uh, this particular time, a friend of mine went and got it all out of the dumpster. I still got the plates and everything. Like this, it was uh, for a band in Italy. This is the last one I just did. It's called Blood. It's, they're called Sperm Blood Shit, and uh, they basically all they wanted was I could do anything I, that I wanted. I just had to have an asshole on the face. So basically, you know, that's my version of Bush as an asshole. For me, like say. If I had to draw flowers or a barn scene, I'd have to work at it. I'd really have to consciously think about it to do it. But if you, like a lot of people before have said, do you do portraits? You know, I would like you to do a drawing of me. And I'm like, yeah, sure, I'll do portraits. If he was hit by a car. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody wanted to know if I had plans when I die, if I'm going to be cremated or buried or whatever. But we've planned, me and my wife, Susan, has planned to, for me to be cremated and packed in bullets, shells, half gunpowder, half myself, and basically it'd be my last art project and it'd be me going out with a bang. Why not you know, for me, I think it makes a good story. If, if you could come up with stuff like I put all this thought into it, had all these weird messages behind it, and I mean, it would make a great story, but I mean, you know, in reality, I'm just a guy that draws weird pictures. I mean, that's all it is, you know. It'd be other people to come up with their own little stories. What's the best way to die? Oh. What's the best way to die? I guess it depends on the situation, but I, for me, personally, I thought if right at the moment that you die, you explode like an atomic bomb and take a city out with you. <laughs>